this project really has been in the work for many years. The past 10 to 15 years, we have grown in terms of our ability to do things here, as well as our ability to do things safely. But we feel that this new lab is going to provide us with a new technology and expand the patient's care, how safely we can do it, how effectively can we can do it, and how that is going to produce a better experience for our patients, as well as a better outcome to our patients. The need is there, the community needs us, the region needs us, and they refer in for our care. And we actually continue to strive for excellence. And as that word gets out and as the need arises, the growth continues. So we have more patients who need a cath, they need interventions, they need stabilized. It's close to where they are, it's close to where they live. We have a regional response to acute events. We often talk about with cardiac care that minutes matter. And when you have a cardiac emergency, driving another 20, 40 minutes into Omaha could really impact the outcome of that procedure. They say time is muscle when it comes to heart attack patients and the quicker you can get patients taken care of, the better outcomes they have. The American Heart Association kind of has the gold standard of a 90 minute door to balloon, meaning when you first have identified that somebody's having a cardiac event, then us being able to open up that blockage with a balloon. We currently are at 45 minutes with our door to balloon times for local transfers. With this space being where it's located directly by the ER, having more space with the rooms being larger, new equipment, staff not being so spread out. I mean, our goal is to be able to even provide quicker care by the location, equipment, and having everybody kind of in one space. You have to invest in the technology, but more importantly, you have to have a, a team, a family that comes to work, is passionate every day about providing the highest quality of care that we can in a very compassionate way. And I, I feel like the combination of those two things Having a strong team and, and now opening up the cardiovascular suite puts us in a, a strong position to take the best care of, of patients in our region for many years to come. At the core of this entire project is the people. It's not just the technology. The technology is a byproduct of what this project is all about. The people, and the people here are the staff, are the physicians, are the nurses, are the x-ray techs, are the people around this community that support this, that really drives this forward. Thanks to the incredible dedication of our cardiovascular team, knowing that we're good, but we can always push beyond, because of that dedication, we will continue to thrive, and this new cardiovascular suite will continue to grow and expand and be able to help folks today and well into the future. The opening of the cardiovascular suite is just another example of Methodist Jenny Edmondson continuing to be the healthcare leader in Southwest Iowa in this region and continuing to be the provider of choice and putting us in a position in the years ahead to meet all the community's needs, not only in Council Bluffs, but in the, the entire region.